How's it going, everyone? It's Jay from TheBeerHeads.com. We're here with another review for today. So without further ado, let's get into our review. Now today, our beer comes from Paso Robles, California, from the one, the Oni Firestone Walker Brewing Company. You might know him as the three-time World Beer Cup champion, as they state right here on their bottle caps. Now, we're going to be doing their one, the only, their famous American IPA Union Jack from their Pale Series. This beer comes in at 7.5% ABV. You can go on their website, www.firestonebeer.com, to get some great info about this beer. They talk about the hot variety and the moss they use in this beer, and about how they ferment it in their steel tanks. Uh, so let's get into this beer, and I'll give you the verdict on Firestone Walker's Union Jack. Now, uh, I tried their Double Jack. Fan of it. I am a fan of it, must say. Uh, that one was just a 10 out of a 10 for me. It was a great IPA. Actually, it was a double IPA, and it was a great one. So let's see if Union Jack can live up to the Double Jack. Because if it does, then Union Jack is going to be my favorite IPA so far. So this is definitely looking like a standard um, IPA. Getting that gold, light orange color to it. Um, it's definitely got that one finger, fluffy white head. Um, a good amount of carbonation in this one. A lot of uh, bubbles on the bottom of the glass. Um, some big carbonation bubbles floating up to the top. Hopefully this is a carbonated beer when I drink it in the mouthful and it's just real crisp. So let's get into the aromas and we'll see what we think about Firestone Walker's Union Jack. Definitely West Coast style, down to the T. Big, bold, grapefruit notes in there from the uh, citrus hops. You can definitely pick those up in there. I believe they dry hop this three times as stated on their website. And you're definitely picking up the aroma on this. Getting that earthy tone, piney, forcey hop in there. This bold. Uh, it's not in your face, but you can definitely pick it up. And it's right there. You're just getting the whole citrus hops, pine hops in there. It's that piney forest, grapefruit, west coast in your face aroma. So let's get into this one and see how it tastes. So cheers, you guys. front of the palate, you get that nice citrus taste, then grapefruits in there, you definitely pick it up, middle of the palate as well, back of the palate, you're getting that bitterness, surprisingly, it's not real strong of a bitterness, it actually blends in, um, it's real balanced for an uh, IPA, it's blending in really well, but after your mouthful, you're getting that bitterness taste after a while, in the finish, and you're picking it up a little bit. Um, definitely a good IPA. Definitely picking it up. Uh, unlike the Double Jack, I could see this one's a smaller version of it. Um, not as alcohol -y, or You don't get that much alcohol taste in it uh, for 7.5. Um, it's not as dry as the uh, Double Jack is that hot, dry finish. Uh, it's more of a chilled IPA. The Double Jack's more of a sipper, more of a hot IPA, if you understand what I mean. It's more of that laid-back, relaxation, imperial IPA you drink. This one's just a more refreshing, sunny day IPA. A great India Pale Ale. Real nice. a little bit better IPAs, but this is real nice. Out of a 10, I'd give this an 8 minus, so I'd definitely give it a 9. Just make it an 8 minus IPA. It's real fresh. It's that West Coast style. Um, it's real bold. Uh, for the Double Jack, I'm enjoying that a lot more. Uh, 10 out of 10 on the Double Jack. This one, I'm going to give it a 9 out of 10. Uh, it still meets the standards of what an IPA should be. Uh, I really like it, and... I definitely would pick this one up again. It's real nice. Um, so 
So yeah, it's been another great beer review, man. So you guys should definitely pick up Firestone Walker's Union Jack. It's just a solid IPA, real drinkable, um, real bold West Coast IPA. What a West Coast style beer should be like when it's an IPA. So till the next time, guys. We'll see you guys later. It's Jay from the Beerheads. Like I always say, live, learn, and drink. Visit us on the website www.thebeerheads.com. Go get some uh, feedback from beer retailers that we go to, um, and other stuff like that. Click on our Facebook as well. Facebook us, you guys. Uh, go on our Facebook www.facebook.com forward slash thebeerheads uh, to go get some great info on us as well. And like I always say, guys. See you guys later. Live, learn, and drink.